Hello, welcome to LRS Fishing, in my house, in the kitchen. Um, I've had a bit of a delivery, I'm a little bit excited. <laughs> what have I got? Well, first of all, you have to excuse the mess, I'm working on my chainsaw, I've got to cut down some, my apple tree's growing massive, and it's the right time you get to cut it down, so, well, not cut it down, just cut it back, so, excuse the mess, I've got everything over that side of the table, because I want to show you what I've got. What have I got? Yes, it's a blue card. But what came with this blue card? This will be a big clue. Come on. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. Got myself Shakespeare tackle box seat. I paid an extra quid and I bought myself the uh, measuring stick. There is some stuff in there. Can you see that? The measuring sticker. But do you know what I thought? Um, let's build it up together. I'm pretty excited. I've always, I've, always, I've wanted one of these pages. I, I usually use like a my big green bag, and um, it's a bit of a pain in the backside. So um, I thought, do you know, what? I've always wanted one of these. There was a bit of a discount going on, so I thought, stuff it. What should have cost me literally ninety quid? Cost me sixty something pounds and a bit of delivery. So I'm really pleased with it. I'm really excited. Now it came with some instructions, and um, yeah, I thought I would just build it up and I um, thought I'd film it, stick it on YouTube just in case somebody else buys it and they can't quite because the, 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 the instructions are there but I thought well why not let's film it I'm pretty excited about it so um, yeah let's build it up now what came with it um, it is just the seat it is just the box but with the drop down option you can get the the um, sort of breakaway um, straps for it um, just to turn it into like a proper seat and uh, like a backpack like you've got your straps to put on your back um, so yeah let's get into it I'm really excited and if you're wondering who's filming uh, usually it's me holding the camera turn the camera around Bella look at yourself it's my glamorous assistant there she is look standing on a chair <laughs> bless her <laughs> look at her little face <laughs> she's a bit embarrassed look she's shy Look how messy the place is. My wife, Gemma, she's not going to be too happy. There's my dog. My missus, she's had a bit of work. And uh, me and the kids have been messing around. Teddy! Teddy! Ooh, 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 ooh. Anyway. So, yeah, this is, this is really cool, this is. I love this. I paid an extra pound and got a sticker. And I put it on the top there. So for when I get an amazing fish, I can measure it up. And, um, yeah. Right. Let's get into building it. <laughs> so, I got it from Jerry's by the way. Jerry's Fishing. Fishing tackle made by fishing people. That's their slogan, something like that. So you open it up. It does come with like a strap just to carry it. But I'm not, I'm not gonna use that. Um, it comes with this little, this little tray. Cause you can put your reels on it and just like little bits of tackle and stuff like that. And of course all your, bolts and stuff but you've actually got a drill into the box now then what's what's interesting about this what they've done I think is really clever actually so I'm gonna get my glamorous assistant to hold the camera while I point it out to you come in lady you hold that I'm just lock this up right then I'm gonna put that on its back now I've already done done this now if you can see here there's a little triangle there was like a little black like a black, that was black, this little black piece, and I've cut it out. And what it does is, if you come over here, and also if you'll notice, I've, I've set, put some sellotape on all, all the corners. Now what this does, it fits into that hinge. Uh, yeah, the hinge just there. You see this little black hinge? So that keeps it steady. And then what they say is to sellotape, sellotape it down. If you could hold the camera for me, darling. Hold it up like that. Perfect. Yeah, so look, it goes directly into that slot, just there. So it doesn't really move, you see? You see this black hinge, just here? And then you cut your triangle piece out and slot this in there, and then you do all four corners. So it literally, let me just sellotape these down here. So 
So yeah, it's sellotape down there. So this now is not moving. Now the reason you've got to do this, now you see these here, them there, them there, and there's, yep, yeah, and here. You've got to drill into there. Now then, it's a five mil drill bit. So these are the instructions. Right, so you need a five mil drill bit, go through there, drill through all four, all four well, eight rather, because there's four sides, two each side, right? But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do some pilot holes because I like to be neat and tidy and all the rest of it and I don't want any mistakes. Um, I'm not, you're drilling into your box, so I want it to be proper. Um, and then you, you fit these brackets, you, you get your screws, which, oh, goodness me. Dog's kicking off. Yeah, so I'm gonna do some pilot holes first. I'll probably do like two mil. I've got some drill bits somewhere. Again, ignore the chainsaw. My drill, bosh! And I've got some little, so I might do like a, okay, so I'll do a three mil hole first, and then I'll jump up to a five, uh, just because I want it nice and neat. And the screws are in here. Yeah, here we go. And basically, you get these screws, and if you can see these screws, and they fit into these like little slot things, and then you screw, you screw it all together once you, yeah. We're gonna sort this out, let me set it up properly so it's like, you can see it properly, and um, we'll crack on. <laughs> Brilliant. Right, here we go. Wish me uh, good luck, people. So, just do the X, X ones first, and then we'll um, go from there. Okay, there's one. The world's bluntest drill bit, <laughs> but we got there in the end. So basically, we've done all these cross ones, so now I'll do all these smaller ones too, uh, the bottom ones too as well. So we'll do exactly the same thing, and then we'll go to a five mil drill bit. So that's all eight holes drilled, so now we're gonna replace the three mil with the five mil. Do all that all over again, and then um, uh, put it all together. There's the holes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All done. You got to put the black backing plates in, which are the backing plates. These uh, these black things in here. And then we all screw it all together. So I'm going to take this off, and uh, yeah, let's get into it. Now it's a bit dark in here. You won't see the well. You might see the holes. See these holes? Now I've got this backing plate. It sits like this, and you offer it up, sort of like that. It sits in there, you won't see it very well, but you see the light coming through there. And uh, yeah, you uh, bolt them on. So we're going to do that now. Right. The wife's back with the boy, so there's going to be a bit of noise. Missy, she's making uh, homemade pizzas for dinner. <laughs> she bought me some beer as well. so. Can't be bad, can it? Anyway, back to this. So you get the idea. I've got the back plate in there. Really, just get a drill, but I'm just gonna show you. So you, you screw them up there, and that will, that will stay nice and flush in there like that. So you do top, bottom, same with this ones, and then those ones in there. So yeah, screw them in, and we'll be good to go. Watch out, done. Right, so I've got the two lined up. So I've did the top one a little bit, not, not I haven't done it really tight. And I'm gonna do the bottom. So my, so my GoPro battery died, and I've actually put my head torch on, because uh, it's without it, it's a bit dark. 
I thought, why not? So as you can see, I haven't quite tightened it down yet. So you've got screws at the top and then the bottom. And I'm gonna do the same with all of those ones down there. Um, the, put through there, the backing plates are on. So now we've got to get these these bits. There's, there's one there and one there and they slide into there. And then you've got these little washers. You see that? Got these little washers and they just screw on and you, it just holds everything in place. So let's do it. See the way that is? Class. Right. And what you do is, you get these like little washers, and then that will go in there. But this is really fiddly, as you can see. And then you just spin that down, and then you get a drill the other side, and get it all nice and tight. See that? Pretty much what you do. So I'm gonna crack on with that. I'm gonna do all, all eight, and then I'll get back to you. Homemade pizza. Come on. Now let's have a debate. Pineapple on pizza, yes or no? I am about that life. Cool, look at it. I've got a beer as well. <laughs> Love it. Can't wait. Get in. Okay. Well then, what I'm going to do is, now you see these little bars here and here. The bolt has got to sit in between there. So these little bar bits. Now then, you, you do this. And it can only go so fast. See, that's stuck now. So if I just give it one more. Now I've got to go to the other side. And, and use the drill and that will make that sit in that in that sort of recess okay now I've got to do the same with all of them around front and back bit fiddly but it'll be dead secure so that'll be really tough on there that will um, so yeah it's just literally got a these little bar bits all right let's get on with it so yeah that is well sunken in there now so I've done that to all of them and I've just got to do I've just got to do these ones now, and then we're done. And then that'll be that. Pretty much done. Right, that's nice and tight. So, that is about it. It's pretty solid. I mean, that, that ain't... That's not going anywhere, man. That is solid. Um, be interesting to see how heavy it is with all the bits and bobs in it. Now then, it's got these bits on the side. If I undo these, you undo there. It's got on this side as well. I've loosened off these straps. So you make sure these are nice and loose. Right, let's just hold these straps up. And it should, you should be able to then just lift this. Right. I don't know how high I can go because I don't want it to pop out that, I think that's a bit too high. So let's try there, and let's do these bits on the side again. Right, let's try it out and see what happens. And that's, that's the seat. And what do you think? Right, let's give it a go. That's pretty, that's pretty, that's pretty solid. I mean, you'd not want to fling yourself on it. It's, just to rest your back sort of thing, just to sit, watch my rods. Bit of a two in one job. I'm pretty, that's pretty good to be fair. Okay. Again, I mean, that that there. Yeah, that's not going anywhere. So then when I want to carry it again, I mean, I might just leave it in that position to be fair. And then obviously, let's have a look here. We'll have the straps a bit tighter. <laughs> That's pretty good. It's quite comfy as well. So there it is. There it is. The Shakespeare tackle box uh, with the breakaway system from Jerry's. Now I have got this tray. Now I'm. I think what's now I couldn't. I, I don't. There wasn't an option to get a few more of these, but I kind. Oh, well, I kind of wish I did. I wish there was because I would have bought a two. So basically, you see these little, I don't know if you can see these little 
gaps there where well, you've got these on there yeah so I've got these little these little tabby bits on the side of this tray and they plug in I don't know if the camera will pick it up or not there we go but you've got these little side bits there and there and the tray just goes bosh you can put your you put your um say pliers like not pliers like um yeah pliers for unhooking fish um your bait elastic because i'm always putting my bait elastic i'm always putting my bait elastic <laughs> like on the floor on the beach whatever and like, oh, i'm always misplacing i'm taking five hours to find the stuff so now we've got this tray on the side and you can put all your little bits and pieces there and oh i'll tell you what and there's another one this side so you could depending on what side you prefer that side as well so there you go so there you have it so there you have it <laughs> that's quality decent i'm really looking forward to giving this a go hopefully we'll be going to the east coast again soon to um do a bit of fishing and just go to the caravan there you go there it is um, so yeah, that's it. I'll just uh, just a quick video really. Um, I just wanted to show you what I've got and what I'm going to be using. And what I'm going to be using. I'm really looking forward to using that. I love this. You know, I'm going to see if I can get some more shelving um, for the other side as well because that is so handy. I've also got my measuring. I'll be catching some big fish with it. I'm telling you, it's going to be good. <laughs> it's quality. It's got all the measurements on here. So you got the bass, uh, bream. Not that I'll catch any of that. Cod, flounder, sole. Pollock. My my recent whales fishing videos that I put up, uh, the one at Amlock. I've been calling it Amlick, but it's not it's Amlock. I actually caught a pollock and I didn't realise and somebody told me in the comment section I miss I miss um identified it and he's like, nah mate, that's a pollock, so I was well chuffed. And I've obviously you've got the place of whiting and um coal fish. But yeah, there you go. I'm really, really, really looking forward to giving this a go. I'm gonna put all my bits and pieces in it. Uh, check check how heavy it is on one thing or another. So yeah, but I just thought I'd put it together with you guys. Um, just if there's nobody know if anybody buys it and I don't know you can't make. I mean the instructions are pretty easy to be fair. But um, yeah, if if you want to know, just type in uh, Alter Builder Shakespeare Tackle Box Breakaway System. I don't know. Um, hopefully my face will pop up and um, it'll be a bit easier for you. Who knows? I don't know. I just thought I'd give it, give it a go and put it together with you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. Fingers crossed I'll have a couple of fish across that measurement. Maybe it'll be so big it'll come off the side of it. <laughs> Fingers crossed, eh? I just want to say thank you for watching LRS Fishing. Uh, please subscribe. It made my day. Again, thank you for watching LRS Fishing. I don't really know where I'm going to be for fishing. I mean, could buy a lake, river, or the sea. Who knows? But all I know is, wherever there's water, I'll be there. Catch you later, guys. Ha, ha, ha.